Hey guys, this is just going to be a quick first impressions of the Batiste Dry Conditioner. It's a smoothing conditioning mist and it's basically a leave-in conditioner and this has argan oil in it. So I will later on be doing a comparison between this and my argan oil and this and another oil I've bought as well. But first of all, this is this video about this. And before I start, I want to say uh, I have blog posts in my blog down below. I, I now have Twitter. I also have Instagram if you want those, links will be in the description. I'll also put the Batiste website down below and Boots and Superdrug where you can buy this from. This is I think between $1.99 and $2.99 depending on what sizes there are where you get it from. So this is quite new, this is one of the few new Batiste products that are out. I did get sent this but I'm not being like paid or anything by Batiste. So this I will get on with the first impressions. So this is a 200 milliliter bottle and this is what it's called. A dry conditioner. Now the bottle has shimmering and I don't know if you can see it because of the light. And it says dry field conditioning mist with argan oil. And you get 200 milliliters of product. Which is 6.73 fluid ounces. Okay, so basically with this, the instructions state, the instructions are on the back, it says spray 30 centimeters away from her after shaking vigorously into the lens and ends and brush and style as usual. So I basically spray this on my hair, leave it for 30 seconds or something and then brush with my tangle teaser and it makes my hair so super soft and this, I didn't know what this was going to smell like and for me this smells not too perfumey, it smells like the Batiste, I think it's graffiti, yeah the, the the graffiti dry shampoo it smells exactly like that it's a nice smell and it doesn't linger so it's just as soon as you spray it that's all you smell I love this it's not as heavy as an oil so this is for everyday use so you need to do this every day whereas when I do my argan oil I do that once every two to four days so I've tended to find that this lasts probably a day a day and a half being really smooth and then need spraying again but it is only like a daily conditioning mist availability it's available in boots and super drug and i'm sure it's available in supermarkets as well it's petite most petite things are it's really cheap i will have to see once i've used a lot more of this product like all of it to see if i'll buy it or if i'll stick with my oils this is easier in the sense than an oil because in an oil obviously you put a tiny bit on your hands, rub it together and put it through your hair and then you've got to wash your hands because they're all either greasy or just not really feeling great. Whereas this you just spray it and it's so so easy, no mess, no clean up, you could take it with you, it doesn't take long at all and it doesn't leave your hair greasy. I've sprayed tons of this on and it doesn't leave it greasy at all. This says you should spray it on dry hair, not damp or wet. So this is for once your hair is dried, you spray this in and then brush it through and then style your hair however you want. I think you could spray this in, style your hair and then like if you were, say you dried your hair and then you sprayed this and then you were going to straighten it, I'd probably wait till after you'd straightened it to put this on or you could do it both I suppose. But it's just really really nice lightweight, it doesn't weigh your hair down and it's amazing. The smell does not linger so you know you don't go around smelling you can't smell your hair at all it's just when it comes out of the bottle it's a clear spray so it's not white like some dry shampoos because it's not a dry shampoo it's a clear bottle i'll try and spray it for you I don't think 
be able to see it because it's just, it's just like a liquid. See it glistening? That's all it is. So, that basically you just spray it on your hair and so I will link all the websites down below and thank you for watching this short first impressions video I will be doing a full review on it once I've tried it out there is one more Batiste product review coming up but that's not as good as this one for me but I'll still do a review on it and my favourites will be coming up next week so stay tuned and like below, subscribe if you haven't already and check my other links out. So thank you for watching guys, bye.